<gasps> oh my god, look at the little infant. Oh my gosh. Okay, he looks a little bit like Chucky, but he's very, very adorable. Whoa. Holy crap. We're one day away from being an adult. Okay, that's scary. So how about Denzel? Nine days? Oh, Denzel is younger than us. That's cool. Yeah. You sure? Yeah, okay. Did it maybe update? No, okay. It's still nine days. Okay, dang. You're so full of logic, you know. Th this game is so full of logic. I love it, actually. What? Okay. Let's do hamburger. Hamburger cake. Hamburger. Let's do hamburger cake. Yeah. Okay. Why are you wearing a Christmas hat? This is really, you know, one of the most cutest interactions that we ever got in The Sims. It's so adorable. Smacking each other with cushions. Okay, Carly, you and your parents are the exact same age. Now, do you know that? Follower update. Today, your follower count changed by zero. Haha, <laughs> relatable. I know I stink, but you, you owe me money, okay? I feel like it's time to evict them because they're just so stubborn. Justly evict. Bye. I hate it when my nose itch for like no reason at all. Howdy ho, everybody. Welcome back to another episode of Playing for Rent. So as you guys can see, I did give Carly over here a brand new makeover. I said that in the previous video, but all of these videos are pre-recorded, just so you know. Anyway, I did mention in a recent post that I am gonna do two to three more episodes on the For Rent Let's Play, and then I'm gonna do like four more episodes on the Crystal Creation Stuff Pack, because I really want to start doing a brand new let's play not really it's gonna be a let's play but it's gonna be a challenge let's play that the legacy started and i am very excited to do it it's called the tiny town challenge and it's a very recent video of the legacy i will post her link in the description so you can go watch that video it's an absolutely amazing freaking challenge i really want to start doing it but i'm only gonna start doing that as soon as all of our let's plays are completely finished anyway um carly just go just get out of the way please i need to readjust the whole house actually because Denzel is living with us now so which means we're gonna have to rearrange a lot of things in the house oh we have a fire <laughs> wait Denzel discovered the fire but he's in bed though but okay I completely lost my train of thought you know like that happens anyway so my PC died and there's this programming thing okay you know he's not lying because he actually does have a PC <laughs> there's this programming thing I've been working on I figure I can use the machines at Geekon to finish up but I don't want to go there alone will you come with me me. um you know what let's bring let's bring denzel along we're just gonna ignore the fire completely actually you know what i don't think that's a good idea we should fix that fire problem where is the fire um so where's the fire don't tell me it's in someone else's apartment what are you doing in our house excuse me oh my gosh it's up here how is that possible denzel just please maybe get rid of the fire stop being a little batch extinguish the fire there we go oh my god there's still fire there's more fire how did this happen what caught fire oh my god i never knew this thing actually goes through i actually why is it the first time that i noticed this turn on excuse me we can turn it on okay well you know what i am such an idiot i never knew this thing was functional i'm so sorry let's clean the <gasps> did the fire kill the dust bunnies but okay anyway denzel was supposed to go to work but he totally missed it for some reason denzel what are you doing Denzel, this is not how we do things. Wh where are you gonna- Okay. Okay, Carly, the fire is over. You can chill the frick down. Okay, <laughs> how are our needs doing? Denzel and Carly, you're both doing fine. Now, I don't know when these two will actually start getting married and stuff. You know, Denzel's a little bit of a player -y player, you know? But the thing is, I don't really think he will actually be unfaithful to us if we're married and stuff. I mean, we are already living together. We are boyfriend and girlfriend. So I'm pretty sure his loyalty will stay with us what's happening over here let's just serve lunch make fried chicken sluggers as far as i know there's no vegetarians in this household denzel did you just pee your pants did you water the bush okay that's fine you know it is raining but it's okay extra water is always a good thing okay now denzel has peed his pants and now he is gonna not do lunch anymore so we're gonna ask carly to quickly do that just make rings and beans maybe all right stop running stop running please the fire is over oh he returned and he's still angry as ever look at that little face he's so freaking cute i think i mean i like them more when they're angry they're just so cool oh my god oh no anyway so yeah 
I don't know if we're actually gonna use Carly's future child or Charlie's future child or the parents' new child, if that makes sense. You know, their newest sibling to go on with any legacies. But anyway, I don't want to ramble too much on one topic. I tend to do that. I should learn not to do that. What's happening over here? Hey, Denzel, maybe go and repair that. We're not really gonna waste money and just replace it because we actually want to save up money so we can somehow, you know, create another bedroom. I was also thinking, you know, what if they moved out and totally forgot about the whole apartment thing? Because this apartment is extremely small. I actually moved her in here because... Sis! <laughs> we actually moved in here because Carly was a single sim for a very long time and we figured she didn't really need a massive apartment because she's alone but now that she has someone in her life and we're maybe planning on getting a child we're probably gonna have to expand the house somehow but I don't know should we move out to a little house of our own that's still in Tomarang or should we stay and manage everything in the little apartment you guys let me know on that but yeah I never knew this thing was functional like how come i never knew you could click on that <laughs> denzel's new skill and handedness will allow him to salvage parts from piles of junk and repair broken objects i'm so happy for you okay okay good 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 okay jeez oh yeah we forgot our our, our lamp outside <laughs> i quickly moved the bed up here to make that lag I don't like that leg. Let's just put it there for now. I just put it out there to readjust the bed. Yeah. It's still hard for both of them to get in here because one needs to get out for the other one to get out or one needs to go in first, whatever, whatever. So far it's working, I suppose. Carly, do you want a child one day? I really want to know. Let's talk about family. Let's see how he feels about it. I mean, we have spoken about starting a family before, but I'm not sure if we're actually going to continue any legacies, you know, with new game packs and stuff packs and expansion packs with her child specifically like i mean we can do it with charlie's child he might adopt he seems like the type to adopt i don't know but yeah let me know when you guys would like to see them get married on the last episode you know like the final episode or would you like to see them get married earlier in the let's play what happened why are you burning you got seriously fried from being when did you get electrocuted <gasps> oh i think it was this thing that caught fire but it's not black like it didn't break or anything but i think that thing caught fire if you ask me the air conditioner thing in magic game carly what how is our apartments doing in general because i really want to know so we have three three and four star okay i said we might actually end the episode when we're when we reached four star and everything because five star might take a little bit forever i don't know but yet yeah, i always like it to actually finish one let's play before wait what balls i like finishing a let's play before whoa thousand something holy shite like i said i really like like finishing a current let's play before going on to a new let's play but yeah it's not like you're hasty on finishing one let's play because like i'm still enjoying for rent and i'm enjoying crystal creations denzel make yourself handy please you are living with us now so maybe clean up a little bit thank you so much what was that that icon i never saw that icon before we can sell these upgrade parts i know we shouldn't really sell them but i mean it's gonna give us some money because we need to make money and the bulls paying just to like a thousand something from us okay now you see this is the problem now she's gonna climb into this side of the bed all right now she's gonna have to get out in order for denzel to get in first which sucks and that's why i've been pondering about just moving into a little house of their own you know start a family retire from this whole apartment thing and speaking of retirement how old are we how far are we from becoming an whoa holy crap we're one day away from being an adult okay that's scary that's scary i did not know we are that close to being an adult how about denzel nine days oh denzel is younger than us that's cool yeah okay yeah you sure yeah okay did it maybe update no okay it's still nine days okay dang carly's gonna be an adult before denzel how scary is that you know i was thinking while we have a little bit of money before we have to waste it on something else maybe we can see what adjustments we can make to actually add another bedroom i think we're gonna get rid of our tv which is pretty sad i know it's for entertainment purposes maybe get rid of our everything up here basically and see if we can maybe move the door to this side flip this okay wait just put it outside for now put the door in this 
snow on this side get rid of this rug or maybe just put the rug in our bedroom this is gonna be an extremely small bedroom thank god the windows align with the wall and everything so it would have been so annoying if it didn't and yeah over here we can have a little nursery i feel how cute is that because i'm pretty sure carly might be the type to want to have kids one day and you know if a new expansion comes soon or a game pack then i mean which it will but when that happens we can maybe use both the youngest sims in one let's play you never know you, do, you just don't know what's coming and you might want to oh i'm gonna use this cc piece it's so adorable you might want to use two sims as main characters for a new let's play on a new pack um what am i doing but yeah as far as i know i would just like to have a nursery because i feel like carly would be the type to want to have kids I actually like the blue and the yellow. I feel like Carly should maybe get, I don't know, pregnant before she turns into an adult. I don't know why. Like, there's no problem in being an adult and getting pregnant then, but... I just want to put a few thingies up here, or in here, to make it feel like there's not much to this room yet. You know, like, a few boxes and stuff. Some random clutter items. How about some toys and stuff? Just to make it feel like there's nothing to this room yet, because there isn't. God, I, I hate it when my nose itch for, like, no reason at all. Okay. I like the little star lights. It's so adorable. Maybe turn this light off for now. But yeah, we have a little nursery. And now I feel like we can maybe still make some adjustments over here. Okay. Because scooching over to use the bed and stuff is is, is getting on my nerves. Okay. Is there, in, is there really no other way we can place this bed? Like, this is actually very hard for some reason. Um, These... Oh my god, I can sell them. <laughs> now, we can't really move the staircase because it's going to interfere with our bathroom you see you see you see but i think we can maybe make things work with move objects you know maybe i'll do a little bit like so okay wait the, the balcony door won't be able to open then oh my god why is this so hard to figure out what if we take oops this away move that to there move the door to this side how will this work i actually think this will work now if we do it this way put the window here the planter under it yeah let's see how functional this is first before we continue okay carly you sleep denzel you sleep perfect okay so we're gonna keep the bed just as it is we can put our little thingy here the aircon can maybe just be above the bed i don't know how safe that is but we'll we'll just put it there for now this can be here tucked away nicely in the little corner there so it's not too much in our way oh no actually we can put it here there we go all right so this works out so far oh my god we really as in seriously really need to vacuum this house it looks horrifying carly can you please just vacuum do a deep vacuum oh my god don't vacuum the bed but okay it's fine Oh, it looks so much better now. Now we're gonna vacuum here and maybe vacuum this room here as well. Okay, we vacuum the whole way. And Carly, you're just... You're so full of logic, you know? Th this game is so full of logic. I love it, actually. And then we will vacuum downstairs as well. Because this this dust... We can't turn it off. But I love the realism. So I don't mind it. Okay, I love how our how clean our house looks for once. Dang. Okay, Denzel. Good morning. Um, It's 2 in the morning. Um, Maybe go make some food actually you know what grab some leftovers we don't need to spend money on making food all the time oh my god look at all the food oh yeah it's because everybody was making food on carly's grill i know every time i say girl it sounds like girl but i really am saying girl Grr. i can't move the food anywhere god just place it in the world okay let's see how this looks like it's, is it still good enough to eat where are you gonna put it now oh you're oh wait you're gonna take it out of the fridge first i'm such an idiot okay does it is it still good okay where i know the house is so small okay uh, we're gonna put it by the bed okay good grab a serving before it spoils no no this is not how we do things denzel carly carly no no clean up please no take the other plate with you oh god anyway good morning my love i know we just had a very weird morning but um let's just you know express our love our devotion our loyalty you know to each other hey gorgeous did you sleep well me too shall we make a baby oh my god you guys she's actually gonna age up today can we do this can we do this uh, i don't know is it too early to get a child should we get married first i don't know you know what i just i just think it's time to age up and you know what i'm gonna do i'm gonna age up denzel too it's really gonna annoy me knowing that carly is an adult 
adult and Denzel is a young adult, you know? If Denzel was the adult and Carly was still a young adult, then it wouldn't have bothered me as much. Um, not cook a grand meal, but let's cook a cake, you know? This is how it goes. Let's cook a cake. We can't make anything, hello? There's no oven. Oh, sorry, Carly, I never gave you oven. You know, if I talk so much, I tend to forget what I was talking about. I'm gonna take this away because I feel like it might be in our way a little bit too. Let's do hamburger hamburger cake hamburger let's do hamburger cake yeah okay you know charlie is still pretty young though he is way younger than carly carly was a child and he was an infant you know a baby so yeah it makes sense that carly is an adult now <laughs> what well, okay okay let's add some candles candles um no candles add birthday candles oh oh wait wait wait. we must be centered let's taste the frosting because that's also how you can age up we happy birthday carly you're too young to be this old though but okay you're too beautiful to be an adult okay you're still gonna be beautiful you're still gonna be super stylish where are you going yay carly aged up beautiful okay you too denzel you're not off the hook Let's go. Blow candles. Taste the frosting or make a wish. Doesn't matter. Just age up, please. Yeah. Okay. Okay. How do we look like though? Ooh, we still look stylish. Still look stylish. I love it. Okay. Carly, you and your parents are the exact same age. Now, do you know that? By the way, can we actually see here if they have aged up yet? You know, our parents? No, they're, they're, they're still adults. That's cool. That's cool. Okay. Anyway, let's call to meal. Have some birthday cake. I mean, we're gonna have to make some massive adjustments if we actually are planning on getting a child. So we have adulted. All right. All right. Which means we have to be more what's happening. Owner grace period. What? The lease length cycle for two Iderer front has reset and the temporary grace period is in effect until 9 a.m. on Thursday. Each time a lease length cycle completes, a grace period will start at 9 a.m. the following day and last for 24 hours. During this time, the property owner is able to evict tenants or raise rent without impacting the unit's rating. Oh, okay. I actually don't really understand that, but <laughs> but yeah, I, I understand it kind of. During this time, the property owner is able to evict tenants or raise rent without impacting Okay, so it's the next morning at 9 a.m. Yes, the grace period will start. Okay, Denzel is off to work, which means we do have a money maker on our side, which is good. We're gonna need the money, okay? Put the cake away. A uh, lottery. Do you think we're maybe gonna buy the lottery? What's happening on Social Bunny? Follower update. Today your follower count changed by zero. <laughs> Relatable. Your style is everything. Teach me your ways. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> we should get together, hang out sometimes. Yeah, sure, we should do that sometimes. I'm, I'm really not gonna do that. You know, if our tenants don't need our help or anything, we're quite actually bored in this Let's Play. I'm not gonna lie. Like, what do you do until the next problem occurs, if I can put it that way? Clean the lint tray maybe that's a good idea maybe that's why it keeps catching on fire we never clean it really oh did you do it that's amazing nobody uses these machines which is interesting everybody goes for the same machine what if i move this to there and maybe put a newer machine in its place for once and maybe see if they let it catch fire again you know like faster than usually did oh yeah the lottery ticket how did how the frick do you buy a lottery ticket oh yeah hundred simoleons yeah sure let's waste our money on on that real quick when denzel returns he should buy one too because we actually might win some bucks you know some big bucks on that so we have a nursery ready not it's not really a nursery because this is a toddler bed we should actually put a cot here a crib but i think we're gonna put the crib someplace else for now i don't know hey mom oh my goodness hey charlie oh <laughs> congratulations on your recent birthday why are you wearing a christmas hat hey mom um invite inside yeah we're not like charlie we're not constantly buzzing we can spare some time and chat with you. Hello. Hey, mommy, how you doing? You look gorgeous in this outfit, by the way, ma'am. Who called us earlier? Oh, I couldn't reach your mailbox, but I managed to throw the mail in there. Good luck getting it back out. Why the frick did you do that? Don't tell me we have balls again. No, we don't. Um, post fine for breaking rules. So, mama, how you doing? You know, at least she does look a little bit older. Not really. She actually looks younger than we do. Um, yeah, sure, Charlie. We can chat. Tenant rule violation. Your attempt to gain compensation has failed. 
Yeah, of course it failed. Like, why? Why is it failing? Why is it failing? I just don't freaking understand. What's your problem? You're not the Glover house. Yes, you are. You know what? Mean. Let's be mean. Let's just give them a rude introduction, although we have already met them. Why are you guys being so stubborn? You're supposed to be helping. You're supposed to be paying your fines, paying your bills, you know, all those things. Prosecute the freaking fine. I know I stink, but you, you owe me money, okay? Do you want me to unjustly evict you? Do you guys know how many times they have refused to pay their fines i feel like it's time to evict them because they're just so stubborn justly evict you're not paying your fines you're not doing what we expect from you and you're definitely very very bad freaking tenants so just go yes go bye now i'm wondering can we move to this unit you know wait but what about your wife your wife is still in that apartment will she be gone too yeah it's 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 empty now i'm so glad that freaking family is evicted because they are just so unfair towards us and everything hey denzel go inside jeez you're old man now you can't be standing like that and you want to have some fun i don't know we can have some fun i suppose it's pillow fight with carly i suppose that's the best we can do in terms of entertainment at this stage this is really you know one of the most cutest interactions that we ever got in the sims it's so adorable smacking each other with cushions i think these two are actually a very nice couple i feel like they they just get along so well although they had issues in the past but that's before they started moving in together and stuff oh and by the way this means that this apartment over here denzel's apartment is supposed to be empty too but why do we still have him living there like that doesn't make sense he's supposed to be living with us oh, okay mom see you later love you bye 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 love ya love you so much okay and you where did i see his face just now you're supposed to be out go away we don't want you here you're a very unjust tenant i want you out so let's see hmm. adult elder whoa this is a massive family why not why not them with what why can't we use them okay it makes sense you know because it's it's 250 per day and that's way too much for one sim to pay so maybe we're gonna take this one you know the sage household let's see how that goes okay so we have brand new tenants oh my gosh hey you're a gorgeous sim by the way hey how are you you're owen sage i assume that's your husband oh my god look at the little infant oh my goodness that's xavier okay he looks a little bit like chucky but he's very very adorable i just love the way how he's crawling you know like on his own and everything just look at him go oh my god okay i'm freaking out like i've never seen them crawl actually i have never seen an infant crawl before in this game so yeah i will freak out a little bit hey wait wait, wait. so your name is juliana juliana i love your little family can i come inside i really no don't eavesdrop jeez carly it's the first First thing you think about come on let's knock on the door and welcome them to the neighborhood <gasps> They have two infants. Okay, now I'm dying. Yeah, no, I knew there were two infants, but I never knew they would be so freaking adorable. It's been a while since we saw infants, you guys. Come on. Oh, <gasps> this one is wearing glasses. <laughs> it's so cute. Oh my god. I'm dying. I'm actually dying. Hey, hey, you know, you should keep your apartment child friendly and, and child safe because um this isn't really safe to be laying around for the little toddlers. I mean, the infants. Hey, I wanted to take a picture of him. He's such an ass. Oh, come, come on. Will you like... Okay, fine. I don't, I don't know. Just do your own thing. Just do your own thing. This one over here is so cute oh my god it's just so adorable okay 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 i think that's a sign that i want to have a child in this game for once again oh embrace the change no we're not self-absorbed i don't i don't i don't know carly as a self-absorbed kind of girl okay so yeah we have a beautiful young family living here now it's so nice to have babies in the vicinity it's so cute look at them go oh he's crying sorry sorry i didn't know um has to be introduced by his mother Z Zaheva, do you? I want to be introduced to the baby, please, through their mother. Oh, oh my god, oh my gosh, why did I? Why am I freaking out so much? I've like seen the infants so much, and it's just been a while since I saw them. Okay, I'm sorry. Oh, we're holding the little one. Oh, Carly, do you want to have a child yet? Are we gonna make a baby? No, okay. <laughs> 
But anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Thank you so much for watching. I know it's sad that Carly is an adult already, but um, she is older. She is much older than Charlie, but yeah. So it absolutely makes sense that we are, that we have adulted and all those things. Um, can you get out of my sim? Uh, oh, no, never mind. The infant is with you. It's fine. You can, you can be, you can be inside of us if you want to. Uh, no, wait, sorry. It's just because of the little baby, okay? <laughs> it's allowed. You're allowed to glitch through my sim for as long as you have a infant with you and everything but anyway guys hope you guys enjoyed this episode let me know what you would like to see happening in the next one and let me know what you think about this legacy thing okay who are we gonna use for any legacy who is gonna create the legacy sums if i can put it that way but yeah i'll see you all in the next one